I wasn't gonna be able to do that. Should I take these out? We're back. And we're better. So in today's video, I'm gonna be trying on a bunch of outfits that I have for Coachella Weekend 2. I feel like I've never verbally mentioned thank you for a million subscribers on my YouTube channel. I definitely did a post on my Instagram, but I've been meaning to put this little guy up for a minute and I'm so proud of it. Like it looks so good on that wall and it's all thanks to you guys. The fact that I've been going to Coachella for the past, I don't know, four years with all these companies, all thanks to you guys. So this is a big fat thank you before we start this video. Now that I have said thank you, let me go ahead and explain what's gonna happen in this video to you. So I'm going to Coachella Weekend 2 with Shein. They are an online clothing store and it's so funny because I feel like I work with them when I was very, very small on YouTube, like back in the old days, like back when I was a lot younger. And here I am like going to Coachella with them, like right after I hit a million subscribers. I don't know if that's saying something to you. To me, that's very like coincidental, but like it's a beautiful coincidence. Like I love that for me. They sent me like a lot. The fact that a hammer is just chilling in the background of my video, like, hey guys, what am I filming? My Coachella outfits. This is uh, my Louis Vuitton chain. What I'm gonna do is try on all these different pieces that I got from Shein. I'll have all the links to everything down below. I have never gone to weekend two of Coachella. I've always done weekend one. And this year I was supposed to double cella, so I was supposed to do weekend one and two. And I was looking forward to it so bad. And then I got strep throat literally two days before weekend one and I was dying. I couldn't go. But I'm not mad about it. I'm still going weekend two. It's not like I'm missing out on the whole festival and I'm really excited to be working with Shein. Also, I'm just kind of excited to have like a fashion show right now and show you all these outfits. But I do need your guys' help. I need you to tell me what outfits you're digging, which ones you like. In the comments, you can just literally just rant and tell me what you think works, what you think I should wear, what you think is a good outfit. I saw Hannah do this on her channel and I thought it was genius. And since I wasn't able to go to weekend one, I was like, let me just do it this week. I will say, however, that this is gonna be my fourth Coachella, which I don't know why, but seeing that makes me feel old. Like I'm not even that old, I'm 18. Every year I'm like, I wanna have the craziest outfits. Like I wanna do this, I wanna do that. And every year I regret choosing like being uncomfortable over being comfortable and having fun. And this year I really want to make sure that the outfits that I'm gonna wear, I'm gonna be 100% comfortable in. I'm not gonna be like, oh my God, my top's falling off or like my pants are too tight and I can barely walk or my shoes hurt so bad and like my feet are or swollen, but at least I got an Instagram picture. Like, I don't want to be that bitch this year, so I kind of want to take it a little bit more easy on my outfits, but still look good. I feel like this is my little runway section. Like, I'll change right here in my closet, and then boom. Are you guys ready? I'm ready. I'm kind of excited. I love trying on clothes that I just got in the mail. Is it just me? Obviously, it's not. Just trying to be a relatable teen. BRB with my first outfit. Okay, so this is outfit number one. I definitely want to incorporate some kind of animal print because I've been really into it, but I can't really tell if I'm like playing the cheetah in a school play right now or if this is like, you know, tropical and like cute, you know? I like the shirt. I like that it has like this little cut here. Looks cute. I rolled the skirt up one. I like that it's flowy. Like this is just so comfortable. I know that if I wore something like this to the festival, I would just like be so comfy and not have a single worry in the world. I just need to make sure it's also cute. I put this little headpiece on because it matches the skirt, but does it give off a Halloween vibe? Like, should I not have a headpiece on? I actually really like the skirt. This with like some cowboy boots. I'm not really gonna have shoes in this. I think one pair of shoes that are really cute that are from Shein, you'll see. I'm obsessed with them. They're gonna be in a later outfit. But for this, I might wear just like black cowboy boots. And I don't know, I'm like really flowy. Do I look like I should like paint on some whiskers and attend a child's birthday party? What about if I didn't have the headpiece on? With that, make it better. This is cute. I like it. All the codes for all the items will be in the down bar, so you can purchase the exact things. I feel wild. I feel catty. I feel like I can dance and not be hot. On to the next outfit. 
I closed that window because it was glaring off my TV. I'm sorry for the inconvenience. So this is another outfit option. This is kind of more of like an IG baddie, I feel like. Definitely have to make sure I don't eat much before the festival, cause you know. Also super comfy though, and I can make it cool with like sunglasses, boots, and like a bandana around my face. And I found this belt off of like one of the other shorts that they sent me. And I feel like that's cool too. Like a video game character. Select your avatar. And I'm like one of the avatars. Uh, there's like a cutout right here. A little scandalous. Nothing too crazy because your girl is not a Victoria's Secret model. The back, it's pretty comfy, not gonna lie. I don't think I would ever be uncomfortable in this outfit because there's you can't really go wrong with it. I have a bandana. That could be cute. I kind of want to do one of those bandana looks. I don't really know how to do them, but they like go over your head like that. Definitely not with your eyebrows in it, but like, you know, have you seen that trend go around? I don't know, this is kind of cute. I like it. Ooh, I'll show you my combat boots from Shein. These are fire. They're from Shein. And I could wear it with these and it would be like a little look. What are we thinking? Let me know. Okay, so this is a dress. It's like the super, again, comfy, like I'm so happy that everything's comfy. Like, can you tell? I actually care about being comfortable at Coachella. So this is a black little dress. It's super flowy and then it fringes at the bottoms. I added this little belt courtesy of Nils Closet. I think it just like puts everything together and gives the dress a little bit more shape. I'll stand on this little stool so you can see. But yeah, that's what the dress looks like. It's cute. This would also look really cute with like booties. Am I right? Or if I did this, what do we think of that? This is another one of the options. Puts me in a dancing mood. I'm gonna be dancing a lot. I should dance after I try on everything, like a dance test to see how it holds up with my dancing. But this holds up pretty well. I kind of like it. Okay, I'm being really annoying. I'm sorry. Uh, next outfit. For one of the outfits of the days, I just want it to be a very girly, like summery, flowy dress. I actually have a couple options here that I want you guys to help me pick from. Just because I think, I don't know, I've never done that at Coachella. It's casual, you know? And I definitely want to do something like that. Kind of like the chill girl vibe, like boho, boho. Except no flower crown. We don't do flower crowns at Coachella anymore. This one's like this purple, flowy peasant dress. The only thing that worries me is the fact that it's off the shoulder. Like, I don't want to get uncomfortable when I'm dancing. As you can tell, I take my dancing very seriously. Like, if I put my hands up, I feel like they go up. But it's not like it's overly uncomfortable or anything. So that's option one of the dresses. Again, I would wear it with like white cow boots, cowgirl boots. That would be it. However, I have more options, so stay tuned. Okay, this is another one of the flowy dresses, but I feel like there's no way I would wear this unless it was like literally hemmed because not that I'm a hoe, just this look is just, am I going to stagecoach or, you know? So I definitely feel like I would hem it. It would just be another like flowy summery dress. Nothing too crazy. I feel like this isn't one of my favorite options yet. I definitely prefer the purple one over this one. So this dress is again, so comfy, so flowy. As you can see, I put two little bobby pins cause that's where I want it hemmed because I'm very, very short. So even a short dress looks long on me and that's not my favorite look. If it were to be short, I would love to wear this and just be comfy and flowy. They just have a ton of like really floral summery dresses. If you're looking for something like that, they'll be links below. And then look how cute it would look if it was hemmed. So that might be one of my outfits. A little snip didn't hurt anybody. Ba bam bam. Okay, this is actually one of my favorite outfits just because I'm obsessed with this crop top. Like this is some I am Gia Revolve looking ass top. Like I might just buy another one just because it's really affordable and it's really cute and I just want to have multiple of it just because I love it so much. This is really cute. It's like this faux leather looking vibe and then I paired it with these. These are really like light nylon cargo pants. Uh, should I step back on my stool so you get a better view? <laughs> stool view. This is what they look like. Ooh, these are fire. They're also really comfy. So I'd wear it with like chunky white sneakers that look like this. 
I don't know. Oh my god, this is cute. I actually really like this. Okay, dope. Lovely. Love that for me. Here's like a close-up. I can get down in these. These are definitely working for me. Wait, I just realized this is very similar vibes to like the second outfit I tried on with the orange shorts and top. Ooh, which one do we prefer? Let me know in the comments. I feel like I can't do both. It's too similar. Or maybe I can do this top with those shorts. Help me. <laughs> okay, I don't feel like myself right now. I like what I did that with the hair here. It's very like different. I think it's a cool vibe. Uh, the shorts now. I mean, I like the shorts. I just don't know how I feel about them with the cheetah print shirt. But could it be cool? Like, is it like, can I make it cool? I don't know what kind of shoes I would wear with these. Booties, cowboy boots, and Louis Vuittons. Not a Dolan yet. I don't know, this little head thing going on is kinda cool. I don't know, I feel like I did it wrong. I feel like I need a better bandana. I literally just pulled this one out of my ass. This is another one of the outfits. I think I could make the bottom situation a little better. I wish I had a black flowy skirt. I, I feel like I just showed so many outfits. I don't know what to do with myself. I need three, that's about it. Okay, well, we have come to the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Definitely try to help me out in the comments down below so I can figure out what to wear this weekend. This little top I'm wearing is also from Shein. Even if you're not really looking for festival clothes and you're just looking for cute pieces to have over the summer, definitely check them out. I'm very, very impressed. So that's why I keep hyping them up. Here's my promo code. If you guys end up shopping on the website, I can help you guys save some money. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you follow me on Instagram to see all my final clothes. Coachella fit and I will see you guys in my next video. I love you guys so much all the way to Pluto and back. Bye!